we are on the lookout for price gouging as it relates to the baby formula shortage crisis. Sean Conroy is from the Consumer Protection Division of the Attorney General's office. In terms of the formula shortage, he says the governor has declared a state of emergency. That means that retailers are on notice that the state will be looking for price gouging. Most retailers are playing by the rules, uh, but, but those that uh, might consider price gouging, that they know this is out there, they know the law is in effect, they know that the, 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 the fines can be substantial. He says there can be legitimate reasons for consumer prices to increase, maybe by a lot. One is the retailer has to pay more for the product, and another is that transportation costs to get the product are going up. If a mother or dad goes in and sees what they think is a pretty exorbitant price, how do they know that there are legitimate yeah. reasons for that price increase? Well, and that's why we're here, Joanne, the Consumer Protection Division. We want to hear from those Georgians that are seeing a substantial price increase that really seems out of line, and we want them to report it to us. Conroy says every complaint will be investigated. He does say a complaint against an established retailer is one thing, but he does warn parents not to go online to websites that they've never heard of. Scam artists will uh, create fake websites. There might be fake postings on social media. Conroy says trying to buy from retailers you know in person or online. And if you think you have been taken advantage of, now is the time to say so. Consumers can file a complaint with us uh, anytime at consumer.ga.gov. And we're, we're here to help. Joanne Merrigan, WSAV News 3, on your side.